Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Rounds, cause my Glock is sober. The chains are spiritual around my neck. My ice runneth over. Oh, you a snake in the grass? Okay, well, I put the knife to Cobra and get the squeeze in. John Morant, proud of 90 bang, soldiers. Bang, I gang. Did they give you Cal? Did they give you Mook? Did they give you Lux? Danny, what is up? You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Sipping tea in my rice gang mug. You will be able to get these very soon. Merchandise is about to be back within like the next 48 hours. We're going to update the website with all the new gear for the new year. But uh, 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 let me holler at you, Danny, what it do here. I want to I wanna break this down the way I feel like it should be broken down because I did a blog yesterday and I just talked about my initial reaction to Danny Myers backing off the card and whoop de whoop de whoop. And there's a lot of people that are reacting and speaking about what has been going on. There's some very powerful tweets out there. There are a lot of people with their own opinion. A lot of their fans that are unsubscribing from the URL app. I will talk about that in one second. I don't know if it's a knee jerk reaction or if it's a culmination of all of the BS that's been piling up for years. I will, uh, I'm gonna just give you what it is so easy to block cap is having the trenches card he books you some artists that are affiliated none of them are on contract just affiliated with url right now a lot of people myself included chris and bias and others you know what i'm saying it was the piper boy williams the angry fans a lot of people was talking about this you know what i mean salute to every single one of those entities and if i forgot you insert your name there to be fair so and jim's you know what i'm saying a lot of motherfuckers talk about this so um a lot of us was, you know, speaking, it's people speak behind the scenes. Yo, what you think is going on? What you think is going to happen? What you think is going to happen? I told Easy when I first saw the card, I said, uh, yo, <laughs> you don't think they're going to block this? And he told me, you know, the artist wasn't on contract, and I understood what he was saying. But I'm like, bro, you've been around long enough to know how they play. You know what I'm saying? And I said it in previous blogs. Danny Myers battles every week. He's probably battling right now. That shit done became a slogan. Danny Myers battles every week. He's probably battling right now. How many times have I said that in the last month? I should give a free mug away to whoever can accurately guess how many times I said Danny Myers has battled. Because I got a number in my head. And I know how many times that I think I've said it. But um, So he battles every day. I seen him battle in Philly last month. He battled one dude, then he battled the kid News outside. He battled on Gates of the Garden and then battled another dude on the corner the same day. Two people in one day I seen him do. And I live near Philly, so I seen this. I know he did this. He was the last one that was on the card. My only issue with the whole Danny Myers thing is you should have hopped out the whip when the rest of them did. You should have hopped out the whip when the rest did. If you knew you wasn't going to stay with it. You shouldn't have played with it, bro. You should not have played with it. Hey, yo, Philly, what up? What up? No, no, I need some motherfucking noise. Hey, yo, Philly, what up? What up? God damn, it's lit. I blam the Sid. Everyone want to be in the trenches till I back out on their ass like Danny did. Let me get started. I got a lot to say today, man. Um, So... I just think that you should have got out the whip earlier. If you was going to get out the whip, you should have got out the whip earlier. And you know you're my brother, you know what I'm saying? I can't watch you die, so I turn my head. I'm going to talk to you soon. I hit you up yesterday. You hit me back. You know, it's, it's been busy. I'm going to get with you today because I rock with him. The terminology, y'all want to know what happened. He got, he got smoked. I'm going to tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was made over Danny Myers. I made, I made a, uh, <laughs> you made it a hot line. I made it a hot song. You know what I'm saying? And this was back when he was battling three, four people in a day and in the same weekend and he wound up battling past Stewie Newton and someone else and he had got smoked. He battled some nigga in Miami. I don't even know who he was. He battled somebody at the ticket counter at the airport on his way to fly the battle pass and I just told him he was battling too much. So I got a lot of love for Danny Myers. You know what I'm saying? I do. I have a lot of love for Danny Myers. But as a media member or a nigga with a camera or a peer or someone with one of the biggest platforms, I gotta call it like I call it so I can't spoil it. I said earlier I tweeted, right? I said, uh, I'm going to tell you exactly what I said. I said, I said, I said, I said, 
First, I said them bootleggers about to do Will Smith numbers. I did. <laughs> I'm saying, I, I did. Because they are. Uh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying. This might be the first time. Hey, yo, Color, you might have to get back outside, my nigga. We ain't got no beef. I ain't never met you. Send me the link, nigga. Send me the fucking link. I got $10 for you. It is what it is. I don't care. Uh, but, nah, shout out to what they doing over there, too. You know what I'm saying? I don't know hate and shit. Um, so, I said, uh, <sighs> I just want Danny Myers to get these big offers without stipulations or ultimatums. If he's a star, legend, bar guard, treat him as one 24-7, 365. Don't do that I cheated on my wife so I gotta buy her a new car bullshit. That's exactly what this is. I cheated on my girl so I gotta buy her something. I gotta buy her iPad, I gotta buy a new car, I gotta get her hair done, I gotta do all this shit. That's all it is. The money that he got offered, the big money, that big bread, he wasn't getting offered that when he was just doing his job, holding it down, battling all the new MCs, trying to work his way up to a Tay Rock battle. When he was giving Tay Rock battles to the Snake Eyes, the Blue Easies of the world, and all these other niggas. That's all I'm saying. Why does he have to do ten times the work to get half the benefit? Okay, y'all not gonna answer. We gonna, uh, okay. It's steeper, your grave's six feet and I'm digging it deeper. That mug is fire too. Shout out to my dog Franklin in the field, man. Um, so... I said, why does he have to do that? Why does he have to be the face of the fuckery, the face of the fall? Because the thing is, the league don't care. They will put you out there to jump in front of the two train and all is well with them. Nothing happens. So I'm going to read you a couple of tweets. Shout out to uh, Mini Kravitz. I'm exhausted. Y'all want people to lay down and be quiet about everything. People don't like how you are all moving. They're expressing themselves. It's a right. Just because y'all scared to talk against URL don't mean everybody got to shut the fuck up. Everybody ain't scared of them. Bad business is bad business. I definitely retweeted that. Shout out to her. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, let me make sure I'm following her because I like it. I, I really like that. Oh, yeah, I'm following her. Shout out to uh, Mini Kravitz. Um, but, yeah, nobody, everybody is not scared. Like, everybody ain't. I don't personally need you all for a motherfucking thing except to drop battles. Just drop battles. We need you for that. We was like, I need you for that. I need you for that. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, hey. We ain't gonna go that far. You know what I'm saying? We ain't never that mad. You know what I'm saying? That's a slogan. We ain't never that mad. I ain't never mad mad at you to not recap no battles. You niggas drop some battles, I'm gonna recap. But for other than that, I don't need you, nigga. What I need y'all for? <laughs> I've shown and proved that ten times over. P, what up? I ain't mad at you, man. You know, they think I'm mad at you, but I'm really not. <laughs> I'm gonna just get paid off of you. I gotta get paid off of you too, you know what I'm saying? Cause the thing is, you ain't want me to get paid when I was with y'all, so now I gotta get paid at your expense. You my boy, you know what I'm saying? We still good, I ain't got no beef with you. So anyway, uh, I called, you know, I said, P is Patrick Mahomes, the players up in the, they calling down the plays to Patrick Mahomes, he's calling audibles and telling them what to do. But it's a group effort, like it's not just one person. They all, it's a group collaborative effort cause they didn't want uh, easy to battle hit, man. Holla. They went all out, Easy had arguments, they told him everything that happened. So, with Danny, I'm hearing he was told that they was gonna break up the two on two. Nigga, they was not gonna, they, they hold you. They was not gonna break up no two on two with Miss Hustle, Luke Castro, and Jerry West that's happening next week just because you was battling on Tracy's car. I, and they would have had to show me. They, I would have been from St. Louis that day. Them niggas would have had to show me that they was going to do that. Now, am I telling you that you should have backed out from a, from a big bag and Summer Madness and Gnome and being on URL? Absolutely not. I'm not. I am not telling you that. But what I am telling you is bagging out two days before an event, that shit makes you the face of fuckery. They're going to kill you. Like, they let you, your company let you be the face of the fuckery all day until easiest event tomorrow. Like, you're going to have to live with the next 24 to 36 hours. Everybody's going to be bombing on you. So, what did Swave say? Salute to Swave and uh, Restore Order and all of that. Do they know the overall damage this can cause? Was it factored into their decision? Do they know that where they're at because of fan support? Where you're at right now is because of the fan support. There are literally people online right now publicly uh, unsubscribing from the URL app. Uh, all Things Battle said the strike 2.5, it had to be done. Posts a screenshot of him leaving the app. Somebody DM'd me this morning and said, this was satisfying to do. And sent me, I, I, you think I'm playing? You think I'm playing? You think I'm fucking playing? And sent me a screenshot of them deleting an unsubscriber from the URL app and showing the pay-per-view cop for the trenches card. Said this was satisfying to do. You know what I'm saying? Dog DM me this morning. I don't want to put their name out there and all of that. 
Was it worth it is all I'm saying. Was a YouTube drop worth all of this? People publicly unsubscribing and letting the world know that they ain't fucking with you no more. I understand URL is a big corporation. Trust me, I get it. You know, they get money. They got all this shit going on. But it's got to sting a little bit when the people that actually help put you in position are publicly against you. It is. Easy might have been a martyr for the situation, but he has a lot of public support. He has a lot of blogger support. He ingratiated himself with the media. He's been on different platforms. He's got his own YouTube channel. And he's got the um, backing of a lot of people. I rock with Easy. Y'all fuck me over, so what I'm supposed to do? You know what I'm saying? I'm supposed to jump in the URL van or the URL bus? No, I don't feel no way about this. I really don't. Huh. Let it burn. Let it burn. They can burn that shit to the ground. I could care less. But the revolution will be televised, and I'll talk about it as much as I want. When I don't feel like, I'll, I'll talk about some battles tomorrow. Um, I do got easy beat and read three auto. <laughs> uh, but uh, you know, they went out their way to sabotage his card, and Danny Myers was hit with an ultimatum. This is the ultimatum rap league now. URL is the ultimatum rap league. You hit him with an ultimatum saying that if he didn't get off the card, he wouldn't get booked again. He wouldn't be on Summer Madness. He wouldn't be on Gnome. And y'all would break up with two on two. I think this is crazy, man. Y'all think this is crazy. And they be wondering why I got away from a bunch of you niggas years and years. Y'all be thinking that what y'all be thinking. That I, oh, I'm this, I'm that, bro. If I told you niggas you would see the furthest thing from the truth, but I let it ride because I'm like, look what happened. I won. And I'm about to be right back on that bloop, 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 real soon. So it doesn't matter. I won. Um, peep, I saw someone say earlier they was trying to compare Norbs to P. You know what I'm saying? They said P is uh, approaching. And I didn't screenshot it, but shout out to whoever it was. I did see it. It was like P is approaching Norb's level of hatred because, you know, whatever the case may be. And my reply to that is they're both kind of the same. Like, they both, they both. They're, there's no there's no one worse than the other. It's just one, shout out to Norbs, I got no beef with you, you know what I'm saying? I'm a Giants fan like you. He was willing to go on social media and defend the brand. No matter what it took, he was willing to go on social media, willing to blog, willing to take all the bullets at the front line for URL, he was, I was there. Nobody in the media could talk about this company and the ups and down bullshit like I can because I was there. A lot of people could talk about what they saw, I could talk about what I dealt with. It's a big, 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 big difference. It's a big difference. They, they could tell you about the movie, I could write the book, is all I'm saying. And I'm not even gonna get into all of that because we're five years removed and I really don't have the hatred. But, uh, so, I say they kind of the same, you know what I'm saying, they kind of the same. I went, I went in and I was, you know, I originally met Norms, was working with Norms, he, you know, let me know, I met P, woo -doo -woo -doo -woo, and we worked together for some time, but then, like I said, you know, I'll make it real quick. Uh, they didn't want me to use my own channel. The niggas didn't want to pay me. And then they said that they had a plan to get me out of here forever. No That's exactly way, what happened. And I told them, I don't give no a way, fuck. Bro. Do what you do. Run with your move. Boy, and no six way, years bro. later, I'm still here. <laughs> Good luck. Try it again. You should try it again, too. See how that go. So, um, Danny got to understand he was used as a public pawn to promote, <laughs> to push and pee. He was promote. He was a public pawn used to pee. He was a public pawn used that privilege to persuade other people to not pick up their packages. That's what you was used. You was used as a public pawn, my boy. That's all it was. And they don't care about your image and your brand or nothing like that. P squared 250 says, I wasn't even watching the battles on the app anyway, but I'm out of here. I can no longer support the fuckery. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what's happening right now. That people publicly unsubscribe. Yeah, and I will say this, uh, for Danny, I rock with you, you're my boy, but when I see someone publicly using you, I have to say something about it. This is 48 hours from the event. This is not three weeks ago. This is not four weeks ago. This is literally you saying you was going to do something, and then after the first wave left, you still saying you was going to do something, then you waited till literally yesterday at like four in the afternoon. I seen him. I seen when you backed out. Trust me. If you think I don't know, I know. They we we're, y'all be thinking the bloggers don't know shit. Bloggers know a lot more than you think. I know who True Foe got in his next battle with the lucrative offer. I don't speak to URL. I'm not on the phone with them, but I know who he got. I, play with me. <laughs> 
We got the power. I'm sorry. We got the power. It is what it is. I know y'all don't want us to have it, but we definitely got the power right now. Y'all might get the ball back one day, but it won't be today. Um, so I'll tell you this, man. Um, they did no URL had posted a flyer for Gnome, uh, uh, for the Gnome Impact or whatever the case may be, and the comments on there are out of control. I'm gonna go to URL's Twitter if they ain't blocked me. You know what I'm saying? They probably don't block my ass. Uh, but uh, they posted a uh, they posted a flyer for the uh, for the damn for the what's his name for the battle that's happening, and then they, they they retweeting a bunch of shit because they're trying to like bury bury the fuckery. I understand that. So. Uh, the, the comments say, nah, I'm good, y'all mad corny, we tired of y'all blocking battles, I've been tired. Then the next comment says, F you, corny, I'm not effing with that app either, I'm not supporting this event, yeah, y'all so lame, we can't support y'all card. Hell no, I'm only here for the replies, uh, dump it with a trash emoji, I will never spend another dollar on y'all events, welcome to the Ultimate Block League, you can't copy respect, but you can take it, nah, I'm good, dub, trash, nah, man. Uh, we good on URL, shameful, URL has sold his soul, you're about to cancel this whole event, watch this, y'all some clowns, URL hit me up, I got the bootleg for free, smack the godfather battle rap, y'all niggas is trash, whole lot of cap, I'm not supporting this, comment after comment after comment, and somebody put up the little cartoon when they had did the uh, bootleg discord joint saying I'm bootlegging your whole event $10 a head, this is all the public comments. Who wants that? Was it worth it? I just want to know if it was worth it. Was taking Holmesy Prep, uh, <laughs> uh, Swamp, and Danny Myers off a card worth the public outlash that's happening right now? And Danny, I respect you and I rock with you, but the whole I got kids and I did it for my kids, that's that's not really going to work because, nigga, you had, you had 30 kids before you was on any of these cards. You had 30 kids 30 years ago. So they're going to burn you. I'm just saying they're going to burn you. We'll see how it works. If the battles turn out good on no impact, I'll talk about them. Am I gonna recap every battle? No, I'm not. I have no intentions on it. But if some turn out good, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, 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 I'ma see how I see it. Be honest, all right. right. I'ma see. That's all I'ma say. I'ma see it. Um Man, this is a this is a really I haven't seen no situation like this before. This is a really it's not a good look, and I don't think that. The, the players that are involved are really thinking about it from that perspective, like what could all possible outcomes be. I'm not saying to just let your artists do anything, because I'm. And let me just be on the other side. I'm gonna be on the flip side. Uh, I was talking to my man, shout out Ray 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 last night, my nigga Ray Bands, Charlotte. You know they know what it is, and he said, and I quote, "The equivalent of what Easy did with URL is like someone putting you on to hustle with them. You know what I'm saying? Like you, you they, they got a spot." They're making money, the trap house booming, they bring you in, they show you their operation, you meet some of the other plugs that are around and then y'all start getting money, whoop de whoop de whoop. Then you realize that there's another spot where they just drop a whole load on you, right? And I'm following, I'm like, yeah, I understand that. You got the whole package, now you selling over here. Then you start saying, them niggas work up the street is garbage, 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 garbage. Them niggas of the work street is garbage. The niggas that you came from. And then you recruit some of the niggas that hustle with them to come hustle with you. They'll burn your whole shit down because of it. So I understand from that perspective, but none of these niggas was under contract. See, that's the biggest thing that is the reason why most of us are speaking and most of us are talking about it. Danny Myers wasn't under no damn contract. So to be over in, in your 40s getting treated like a nigga on contract when you're not on one, sorry. Never gonna be able to subscribe to that. I'm sorry, I cannot subscribe to that. Because they basically hold you. You're not on paperwork. None of y'all are on paperwork, but they put you on it. Now, and they did they basically hit them with a cause I said so. What why can't I do cause I said so. Since I said so. You know? And you know why. And um, but what I would tell artists out there, because I know there's a lot of battle rappers and people that watch it, like, if you know niggas got a situation, you might as well not even do it. You know what I'm saying? Because you you won't go through this. Um but the final word, y'all burned down, y'all was trying to burn down Bill Collector for fucking 48 hours about who leaked the card, not knowing that this was around the corner. That's the reason why I ain't go too crazy when the whole Bill situation happened. I dropped one blog telling them, yo, you need to chill, don't crash out about the internet. But I knew, when I made the blog yesterday, and I was like, yo, Danny ain't posted a flyer in three weeks, he's not promoting, he got a, a double impact flyer up here. You niggas think I just be saying that shit for my health? You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'm looking at what's going on here. The optics is saying that he's not promoting anymore. He's probably coming off the card. Uh, I just hope that it was worth it at the end of the day. But 
<laughs> you can't spell Ultimate Rap League without a L to it. Uh, P, if you, if y'all niggas want, I can get this out today. As a matter of fact, I got a box over here. So if y'all want me to get this out today, I can send this to, uh, I can send this to Chico. I can send this to Beasley. I can send this to Smack. Uh, whoever you want me to get this out to, just give me an address. Y'all niggas know how to find me. Just give me an address, and I'll get this out. I could go to the post office once I leave, because I got a, uh, some business I got to attend to. I'm actually about to uh, lead a state. I got some bigger shit going on, and y'all about to see what's happening with that real soon. And uh, I can get this L out to y'all, because uh, it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to go I'm gonna go ahead and head out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all have a great day. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you know, you know. They put my man Danny in the dummy office. And this ain't nothing really for me. I'm just gonna make some money off it. I'm out, gang gang. Shout out to my brother Showtime SP. Yeah, but Rounds, cause my Glock is sober. The chains are spiritual around my neck. My ice runneth over. Oh, you a snake in the grass? Okay, well I put the knife to Cobra and get the squeeze in. Ja Morant, proud of 90 soldiers. I gang.